Why is it that you always thought yourself so much better than me? Why was it always you who was given the golden opportunities? Why was it always you who got just what you wanted? Why? Hmm? Tell me why! Well, no more. I will be second best no longer. You will outdo me no longer, Hendrik. This time it is I who have been chosen, and you who will fade into obscurity. Huh? So, uh, what did we just see? At the end there, hmm? that looked like the throne room in Heliodor. The place was a ruin. And that man Hendrik was doing battle with, could it have been Jasper? I cannot say for certain. Yet I have seen that scene before. Somewhere. This shadow. Could it have something to do with the visions we just witnessed? Come, we must go after it.
It has been years now since that fateful day, when the darkness first descended and tragedy befell Dundrasil, your home. Jasper and I stood together at the head of the force that succeeded in driving back the monsters and escorting King Carnelian to safety. Little did we know that the man we strove so hard to protect had already been possessed by the fiend Mordigan. Upon our return, his majesty made me a general for my deeds that day. But I did not rescue him alone. Without Jasper's bravery, all would have been lost. I urged the king to recognize my old friend's valor, but he paid me no heed. Jasper was not rewarded for his bravery. He was ignored, ostracized. This must have been Mordigan's plan all along. To wound Jasper, let the darkness fester in his heart, then use that resentment for his own ends. Why could I not see what my master had become? And why was I so blind to the darkness consuming Jasper's soul? It is you. Come, we must see where it leads us next. I sense it has something important to tell us. We sparred here back when we were young. Jasper, show yourself. They say those the monsters take before they finish their business in this life come back as bitter black spirits. Looks like that's what we're dealing with here. It's Jasper like as not. Why? Why did this happen to me? Why? <gasps> I'm sensing a horrible, ugly hatred. Careful, everyone. I don't usually make it my business to fight vengeful spirits. But something tells me we don't have much choice. Let's do this. This is not your fight. I must face him alone. Hendrik, that's not the man you knew. It's nothing more than the darkness he left behind him. A darkness I helped create. A darkness I must destroy. Alone. Let us bring this to an end. Come, Jasper! It is time at last. You are mine, Jasper! I must put an end yeah. to your suffering, once and for all. Take heart. Yeah. <laughs> 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 
Paths diverged. Were we truly once allies? <laughs> My voice anger <laughs> reaches him. <laughs> if I am partially to blame for your <laughs> then it is also my duty to end it. Your pain ends. <laughs> Again you surpass me. Again you outdo me. Again you you leave me behind. The more you bathed in glory, the more brightly you shone, the more I receded into shadow. Do you know what it was? That I always wanted. I wanted to be like you. Jasper, you speak of surpassing me, but in truth it was I who always followed in your wake. I was robbed of my home, my family. I was alone. You were the one who spurred me on in their place. The light that guided me. <laughs> you are the same sentimental fool as ever, I see. You do remember that I betrayed you? How could I forget? I am indeed a fool, but not for that. For not seeing before it was too late. If I had spoken to you, if I had listened, perhaps I could have saved you. You knew. You always knew. We were born two very different souls. It was that difference that brought us together. As your light grew brighter, mine could only blacken in response. And before I knew it, I felt more kinship with the denizens of the dark you battled so righteously than I did with my own kind. The lure of evil grew. And before I knew it, I had passed the point of no return. I saw then what Mordigan saw. The beauty in the blackness. Shed no tears for me. I seek no sympathy. All I ask is that you answer one question. Do you still... Do you still consider me your comrade and companion? Always. Friend. How long I have waited to hear those words. Do you remember the pact we made as boys? Come. It is time we made good on our promise. The two-headed eagle cannot fly with just one wing. 
from this day forth, my spirit shall stand alongside yours. We will never be apart again. <laughs> oh. Forgive my self-indulgence, but know that I have not forgotten my pledge. I shall be... No. We shall be your sword, your shield, your unswerving companions, my oldest friend and I, together. Though it was long in coming, far too long. We are united at last. <laughs> 